Hello once again, I'm Jim Ducart with TND How Videos. Today we are going to be watching part one of a cable replacement project at the Meritex Caves in Lenexa, Kansas. Our participating utility is Kansas City Power and Light. Our video sponsor is Burns and McDonald. Now to set the scene here, what we are seeing is a single distribution pole that doesn't look like it serves anything other than taking in power those three phases or three lines up on top. We've got three guys up in bucket trucks, uh, two at the cross arm level, one at the top of the pole, and what they're going to be doing is preparing a cable feed from that pole down 80 feet underground into the Meritex caves. Now to start with, here is those same linemen from a different view up on that pole, that distribution pole, and what one of the linemen is doing is attaching a collar to the new 4 aught copper distribution cable that's going to be used in this cable replacement. And it's got a two-part collar system here, and the guy up above is going to actually use the his boom to lift the cable vertically and form it into place right alongside the pole. And now we see the view from up on the bucket as he grabs this plate with three openings in it. The three openings, one for each of the three components of this 4 aught copper cable. Here he is again from the ground view sliding that plate over the three parts of this cable. There's a rubber grommet that sits between the collar and that plate. Now we see him taping up the three components of that cable so they can be pulled into place as a uniform cable. And now he's going to install what's called a Kellum grip, which is a wire mesh grip. It's going to allow the guy on the top to use a boom to pull that cable into a more uh, direct vertical position. Now here we are back up in the bucket and you can see the collar and the plate above it and the grommet in between. He's looking up because they're using the boom up above to pull that cable into position. And he's going to continue here uh, to try and uh, work that collar and plate assembly down on the cable. Next we see uh, now that the cable is in place uh, all three or both bucket trucks working on securing it down and as they pull away from the pole you see to the right here a cable pulling reel come into the frame and let's take a look at what that's doing. Here that is the other end of that where they're actually making fresh cuts or fresh uh, terminations of the cable on that reel. This cable is actually going to be fed down into the caves. And now we've got one operator standing in the enclosure, another helping feed the cable down into the enclosure. This operator now using a remote control to guide the cable down. You see him put a collar on an opening here that leads underground. He's also going to install or place another Kellum type device, wire mesh device, which they will expand so that they can pull the cable when it gets underground. And that concludes part one of our TND How video on cable replacement at the Meritex Caves in Lenexa, Kansas. This is just a picture of the original distribution pole with its cable, 4 aught copper cable, ready for connection. The participating utility was Kansas City Power and Light. This video was sponsored by Burns and McDonald. I am Jim Ducart with TND How Videos. Thank you so much for watching.